So I'll tell you the longer story. When I got out of school, my goal was that every four years I would produce a short film. Mm -hmm. You know, some of these guys, they can do it many films in one year, but I can't do that. But to me, I felt like life can go really fast. And if I don't make a goal to do a film every four years, I'm gonna be 60 or 80 one day and go, where's all those films I made? I didn't even make one. So if I at least set a goal, I think that is realistic. The hard part is actually doing it. So, you know, I prayed about it and I feel like my, my prayers were answered because not only am I getting to produce a film, I'm, I also don't have to promote it. It's also not for myself, it's for God. And it happened in a way that's better than I, I could imagine. When you watch a movie, it's very mysterious how it's working. They didn't shoot the scenes in order. The actors didn't act in order. They might have acted this scene first and then this scene. And then they're cutting, you know, they're showing, they're showing different uh, moments, but they're reenacting the moments and putting them together to create a new moment that never existed. So when you watch a film, it's like, it's working because of a team. The sound guy had to make it work, the music guy had to make it work, the, the camera guy had to make it work, the director, the storyteller, writers, they all had to do their part. And then the actor has to make it work. I would rather be living the rest of my life curious about the mystery and the magic of movie making. And to me, God's a part of that, you know. <laughs>